So as you can see by the title of the video, what you're about to watch may contain some huge spoilers. A new Super Smash Bros. Ultimate character may have just been leaked. If you don't want to be spoiled, if you don't want to see what potentially could be in the game, again, not, this isn't confirmed, but it's looking pretty likely. If you don't want to see what's going on, click off the video now, because we're about to get into some spoilers. So, I have to give a huge shout out to Keyblade Smasher. Um, you may remember him from some of my previous discussions. He is the one that um, kind of gave me the information to make this video. He was the one that made me aware of this, so thank you, man. I will leave a link to your channel in the description of this video. But oh my goodness, massive spoiler warning. So we are on um, Game Facts here, and this is originally from 4chan as I understand it, but this has been shared around because I think the original post is gone now. But all the information we need is here, so I'll leave a link for this in the description. So Super Smash Bros. Ultimate message board, 4chan leak about Dante got more credence today. So Dante from Devil May Cry um, is I guess a fairly requested character for Smash. I personally have no emotional attachment to the Devil May Cry series. I've never really played it. Uh, I know enough about it. Like it's, I guess it's like a hack and slash kind of like Bayonetta. Um, but I've never played it. I've never really paid much attention to it. But it's looking like Dante is going to be a new character in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate based on this leak, this supposed leak. All right. So again, nothing's confirmed, but let's get into this. So uh, basically, so there's a bunch of information here. Um, where this guy is saying like hey this is how this is what's gonna be in Devil May Cry 5 this is you know some of the features of the game yada 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 well there was a trailer earlier today Gamescom which is going on in Germany there was a trailer from Gamescom for Devil May Cry 5 which apparently got a bunch of things right it, it got how the dynamic music works how saving works for Nero again I don't know what this stuff means I'm not a Devil May Cry person and what the training room looks like but based on the little research that I did, it seems like this guy did get this right with the trailer. I watched the trailer, and it looks like this guy did get this stuff right. Um, he also, I think he calls it some other stuff in here too, but the fact that he got this stuff right seems to lend a lot of credence to this rumor. He seems to know what he's talking about. And then he followed up with this. Uh, the trailer opens, so um, he he leaked about the um, you know Dante being in Smash Brothers. He's like, one more thing. Dante is going to be in Smash. And then someone asked, hey, can you elaborate on this a bit? And he says, yeah, sure thing, Anonymous. The trailer opens with a CG, uh, so a CG video of what I think is one of the Fire Emblem characters being attacked by a giant dragon. But before the attack connects, the screen goes dark and you hear the Royal Guard parry sound. When the video resumes, they show his eye catch, Dante rocks out. So, you know, the, the splash screen or whatever, like King K. Rule comes aboard. Um, and then they show his gameplay. Again, I'm not a Smash guy, so I can only say so much, but I do know my Devil May Cry. He uses his outfit and most of his weapons from 4, although I didn't see Pandora. Um, whenever he, And that would actually make sense, because if they are... So if they're using... If Sakurai and his team are using the Smash 4 fighter ballot um, to kind of, you know, influence the newcomers of Smash Ultimate, that would make sense if he's based on Devil May Cry 4, because that's, that's what would have been more relevant at the time. It's similar how the Inklings are based on their Splatoon 1 incarnations rather than Splatoon 2. Um, so he goes on about a little more about Dante and Devil May Cry. Again, really don't know that much about the series, but I think he also mentions that Lady is shown as an assist character, also in her Devil May Cry 4 outfit. Uh, she jumps in and starts firing shots everywhere. So again, I know nothing about the series, but it seems like this guy really does know what he's talking about. Um, and the fact, again, the fact that he got multiple things right about Devil May Cry 5, that's pretty, like, when someone gets something right about, like, you know, if someone calls a Nintendo director, calls how a trailer is going to work, like, that's really, really, you know, you can't argue that. They, they obviously knew what was coming. So, I guess that just begs the question now. What do you guys think about this? Do you guys think this is real? I, I, per I personally think it's real. Again, I don't know much about Devil May Cry. I know I've said that a bunch, but I he's, he seems to check out. Nothing here seems to be, you know, janky. Nothing seems to be mysterious or doesn't add up. Nothing seems to contradict anything. And hey, Nintendo and Capcom, I think Devil May Cry is Capcom, uh, they have a really good relationship and we already got Mega Man and Ryu, so another Capcom character isn't super crazy. But yeah, 
let me know what you guys think about this in the comments down below. This is really, really crazy if this is true. Hit that like button if you enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already for more on this potential leak and other Nintendo goodness. And again, shout out to Keyblade Smasher for hooking me up with the information. I appreciate it, man. Alright, see you later, guys. Bye.